as women in Kenya we've suffered a lot. As you know, the high the rate of poverty in Kenya is too high. Mm -hmm. So this has led to mostly right right violation, especially to ladies mm -hmm. or girls. Their rights are being violated because you see, somebody may come and tell you that, you know Mildred, you don't have money and I want to befriend you, something like that. But not really that he wants to be, be befriend you, but just to misuse you and after that leave you there. Just on just on a on a small pay. And some some ladies are also being raped because they are unable to run, especially when we walk in darkness, you know. There are some arrogant people who they don't understand and they don't have a proper understanding about what person with disability is. And they they don't also don't regard us as human beings. They see us as, as something, an object that should be just be misused anyhow. What should be done is that the community should be trained, should be capacity built on first human, first human rights training should be given to all the community, including the person with disability on the ground. They should also be trained on issues on rights, human rights education, and another one I feel that another change is that the issue of HIV and AIDS, it's also another big, it's also another big disease that has killed most of our, of our members. As you see, most persons with disability do not know that they can also, that they are also vulnerable to HIV and AIDS. So education, I feel that they should be trained on the prevention of HIV and AIDS.